Hey y'all, am I the only one this happens to? You have a light breeze going on, you start a fire, and the wind kicks up. Without fail, every time. As you can see, the way I work a burn pile is a lot more labor intensive, but it's because I'm trying to get something out of it. If I wanted to, I could just sit over here on a stump, have a beer, let this burn down most of the way and call it good enough, but I'm trying to get the biochar out of this, so I have to keep feeding it and mounding it. I'll use a shovel to scoop the outside stuff in and keep creating this smoldering pile that all becomes charcoal and then I'll extinguish it and I'll have my biochar for my gardens. If you leave it spread out, it just turns to ash, which is great for soil amendment for right here, but it doesn't do me any good over there. All right, I think y'all get the basic idea. I gotta keep working this in, adding fuel, working it in, adding fuel, get it all burnt down. I'll come back and show you what it looks like when I get a little closer to done. I think y'all are getting the point. We spray it until there's literally no more steam coming out and we know it's all the way extinguished. And then uh, we pile it back up and we have a pile of biochar. All right, y'all, so there we have it. We'll probably add a little more water just for safekeeping because of the fact that uh, there is still some steam coming off of it. We don't want it to break down too much more, but there is a big old pile of biochar. So it'll just sit out here in the pasture for a week or so until it kind of dries out a little bit and more of the ash washes down out of it. Like I said, these pieces over here will just go in the next burn pile that we do. We'll hose them off and make sure they're extinguished. But uh, that's biochar. So as you can see, very labor intensive. It would have been a lot easier to push this pile and walk away, but then I wouldn't get nothing out of it and my gardens wouldn't get nothing out of it. So hopefully soon, you will see all of this charcoal 
turned into or turned into fruits and vegetables and other cool stuff. I've got a lot more work to do today, but right now I need to take a breather. My face is all sunburned. I need to go grab some aloe and put it on it. And uh, my knees are telling me it's time to take a break. So I'm going to take a little bit of a breather and then we'll see what else we can get done today. A lot of work on the homestead on Saturdays and Sundays when you both have full-time jobs. <laughs>